All right, so here's gonna be another variation. So we did the Kimura sweep, and then we did the Kimura, and then we counted the Kimura with the shoulder lock. And so right now, I'm not gonna be able to do anything. Why? Because he's gonna defend his hands, he's gonna lock the hands behind his thigh, he's gonna drop his leg, he's gonna make it difficult for me to break his grip. That is another way to break the grip, but I have to work harder. I don't wanna work as hard, okay? So what I'm gonna do right now, so I'm going for the sweep, he set the leg up. So I'm going for the Kimura. When I go for the Kimura, he grab, he grab inside his leg. Most of the people make the mistake right here to go back, lay down on the back. So after you lay down on your back, it's gonna be hard to create all the attacks, okay? So here I'm gonna do. So I'm going for the sweep, he blocks. So I'm going for the Kimura, he blocks. So now look what I'm gonna do. I wanna stay up tall here on my elbow. Okay, so I got the grip here, and I don't want him to know that I'm going for the Kimura, if I'm going for the guillotine right now. So when I keep doing that, try to break his grip, he keep posting it up, he keep lifting his head up, being strong. So now look, guys, what I'm gonna do. I wanna sit a little bit taller. So with my right foot, I'm gonna scoop my butt back a little bit, that way I can sit a little bit taller right here. Okay, look, my leg's still here, tight to his body. Now my right hand, look, I'm gonna do. I'm gonna let her go, my wrist, but I'm still holding his wrist with my left hand, okay? I don't wanna show him I'm going for the attack here. So I'm gonna bring this hand all the way around, look. And I'm gonna cop his chin. Okay, so I was here, I broke the grip, let her go the grip, come all the way around, cop his chin. So when I cop his chin, I don't wanna know space, so his head stick out. So as soon as I cop right here, look, I'm copping deep and I'm squeezing my elbow tight to his ear. All right, so now look, with my left hand, I'm gonna shoot my left hand right here and grab my wrist. I don't know if you guys can see this grip here. With my left hand, I'm gonna grab my wrist. So I was here, okay? So I brought my hand all the way around, cup his chin, and now look, this hand here, I'm shooting and grabbing my wrist right here. Look, the grip. Now, I'm gonna stop, pull this up, and I'm gonna do a body rotation this way here. I can close my guard, but honest, I like to do, I like to put the foot on the hip and push right here, create an angle. So my grips here, I was copying him right there. I brought my hand all the way around, grabbing my wrist. So I'm gonna hip scape out to my left, and I'm gonna pull this up, creating an angle, making it harder for him to fan. Okay, so now, let's do this size right here putting everything together. I went for the sweep. He stepped the leg up, block. I went for, the, hold on, let me go for the Kimura first. You're too fast. I'm going for the Kimura, he blocks the Kimura. I don't want to lean back, because here I'm going to be able to do the guillotine. So when you walk, again, start over. So when I go here for the sweep, didn't work. The Kimura, he blocks, scoop back a little bit. Keep holding the wrist. Now look, Cut, bring my hand all the way around the cup his chin. Stay tight right there, okay? If you guys feel like you're gonna fall back, use this left foot, scoop back a little bit. Shoot my hand over here, grabbing my wrist. Look, I'm super tight on him. My elbows are tight. Steady go straight back. I'm gonna shift my hip this way, put my foot on the hip, and push, creating a rotation here. Here, I have to squeeze hard to get him. Here, I create a little body rotation. I'll be able to choke him faster, all right?